So this is really cute. I've got all the Pomeranians. Don't bark at me, Miss Abby. Listen, Miss Abby Rose. We've got all the palms in the same place on the bed. How many palms do we have? We've got, we've got Yeti. Hi, Yeti. One. And Abby. Two. And Angus. Hi, Angus. Three. And Jumanji. Four. And Andy. Andy. Five. And Moxie. Moxie. Six. And way over there, Miss Polly Pocket. Seven. And then what is this? One of these things is not like the other. Uh-huh. That is a Chihuahua. <laughs> Hi, Yeti. Thanks for settling in, sweetie. So Yeti's here just for the night. And um, Abby's here on a three-week vacation while her dads are on their own awesome uh, vacation. And she's doing great. And Yeti's doing really well, too. And those guys all, all live here. Yeah. What's wrong, Abby? What is it? Are you bored? Do you need entertainment? Abby's a puppy, so she, she likes to be entertained. Oh, my God, Yeti, you're so cute. Um, so we're going to play some games in a minute. One of her favorite things is my hair ties. And also she likes it when I take a poo bag, obviously not used. <laughs> and tie a knot in it and play with it so we're gonna do that and wrestle a little bit uh anyway yeah those guys live here so the jumanji was uh, re uh what do you say Ugh, surrendered about three months ago now to our dog sanctuary and that chihuahua over there came to us from another rescue that needed help the foster fell through and uh, little Polly Pocket there also came to us about, I think the same time as a little bit, maybe like a month before Jumanji. Um, she needed a, a place to park as well. And Moxie belongs to me. She's my own personal woofer. And Billy uh, was rescued from a backyard breeder. He's my son. Yes, he is. I don't care what anybody says. And Angus came, um, from a client who uh, couldn't keep him anymore years ago. So these guys are all permanent residents here at the Woofer Walker's Doggy Day Care Resort and Sanctuary, except for you two. You two are guests and you're lovely guests, I must say. Oh, and this is Bowie. He was surrendered here about seven months ago. Three-legged border collie. He's tired. He's had a big day. There's Dahlia. She's from Thailand. She's been with us many, many years, many years. She comes from a wonderful rescue organization <laughs> called Soy Dog. Soy Dog uh, rescues dogs from the illegal dog meat trade. Um, she was one of our fosters, and we did get her adopted out, but the people returned her after, can you believe, three years. And so we let her stay because we decided, you know, we're not going to let her down. She's, you know, she can stay forever. She can stay forever. You have a lovely home. You do have a lovely home. When your dads get home, they're going to be so happy to see you, Abby. They're going to be so happy to see you. Yeah. Hi, Abby. Hi, baby. Let's get you a toy or something. You want your you want your little bag thing? Yeah. That's better than chewing on my, my jacket. Yeah. I know most people are like, why are you letting her chew on poo bags? Well, like I said... You know, she wants to play and she gets bored of uh, the rope toys and stuff. And this is crinkly. Listen, you know those doggy toys that have crinkly stuff in them? Yeah, well, we're fresh out of those right now because stuff doesn't last very long around here because we have 18 rescue woofers living here and they all tear apart the toys and eviscerate them. And they just get washed a lot and wear out, you know, because we have to do laundry every single day and wash everything every single day. So stuff wears out quickly. Um, by the way, when I say that, if you have any old dog toys that your dogs are sick of or, you know, whatever, you just don't want anymore, we are always happy to take donations of dog toys and blankets and dog beds. Those are our, oh, and dog food. Of course, if you ever feel like you want to donate some dog food, please, 
That would be fabulous because we are feeding a lot of woofers. Anyway, um, happy Friday. It's Friday. This is how I'm spending my Friday as usual, partying with some awesome little furry friends. Pretty soon my um, friend, my best friend, BFF, DJ Jeremy Warren is going to be playing on Twitch. He um, <laughs> he is a DJ. He used to DJ at Love Affair. If uh, That's how old I am. I used to go to Love Affair. It was a club in Vancouver. <laughs> Hello, sweetheart. Um, it was a club in Vancouver, and I used to go there in my 20s, 30s, 40s even, and uh, D- the, he was the DJ. He was the main one of the main DJs. So if you're interested in checking out his Twitch channel, he does take requests all night. He'll play whatever you want. Um, if he has it, he'll play it. And he has awesome graphics and stuff like that. And it's again, it's DJ Jeremy Warren. I will also put it in the comments. <laughs> okay, I'm going to get you a new one because this one's getting dog-eared. Ha <laughs> ha, dog-eared, get it? Happy Friday, everybody. <laughs>